Hey everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to the channel, Dylan here. So we have an awesome video for you guys today. So please thumbs up the video, make sure you're subscribed. And before we jump in, wanted to tell you guys that about an incredible opportunity right now to start making money just by making little videos promoting products like this car charger, like this uh, other car charger, like these little games right here, um, this digital camera, or like, you know, products like the C4 energy drink. You can make money right on TikTok now on your phone. It only requires a few minutes a day to start making money on it. And you don't need an experience or a following and you just do it on your phone. You don't need to show your face or anything. Click the link below if you're interested in this to join my TikTok shop program and learn how people are making thousands and thousands of dollars per month. They just made it super easy for anybody to start doing this. And right now there's a 30 day free trial to sign up, try it out, see if you can start making money. If you don't like it, you can cancel at any time. So check the link out below. Let's get started with the video. Can Uber and Lyft drivers... Oh, what? This was not the, the one I wanted to bring up. Um, Hold up. I literally just had this. Can Uber and Lyft drivers file for unemployment benefits? Okay, you read this? Yeah, so self-employment and other work slash general. Section 1252 states in part, an individual is unemployed in any week during which he performs no service and with respect to which no wages are payable to him. So basically the question was, can, can gig workers file for unemployment benefits? Like if you're unable to work, um, if you you know, get deactivated and there's, or whatever, whatever the case. And it's like the gig working is something that you've been, you know, relying on for work. There's kind of work around here is that, um, okay, you want to read this part? Can you see the screen? Yeah. Okay. So basically, employment under the Unemployment Insurance Code has been defined as a service performed for wages or under a contract of hire. Service is defined as performance of labor for the benefit of another or at another's command. Therefore, a person who is self-employed or an independent contractor is unemployed within the meaning of the Unemployed Insurance Code since such a person is not performing service for wages under any contract of hire or at another's command. So does that mean they can file for unemployment? I th yeah, I think so. Can I file for unemployment? I guess. What do, what do you get, like 800 a week or something? <laughs> I don't know. 800 that, a week? No. Isn't that what you get for unemployment? Or No, that's so much money. That's what, like, someone I knew was getting, like, 1500 every two weeks. Back in the lockdown, and that was only during a very specific time. Oh. And that was federally funded. Oh. So the state unemployment benefits are typically like, like one to 200 a week. But at the time, the federal government was funding a $600 a week um, amount. So, so it, but in addition to that, so a lot of people were getting, you know, close to like a thousand bucks a week. I should have been one of those. <laughs> and apparently some people were like doing all these workarounds where they were finding people to do it. And then they were like setting up all these accounts so people could like get all that money. Because it was like already allotted money that like the government, you know, passed this multi-trillion dollar package yeah um, and so there was a huge huge amount of funds federally that was allocated for unemployment benefits so i mean it was like if you did yeah if you worked during that time it's like if you worked and you were making less than a thousand a week it's like you're basically working for free because you could have just filed for unemployment benefits gone you know anywhere from like 700 to a thousand a week and you just basically basically had to apply and click a box saying that you were like afraid to go to work because of everything that was going on. Oh, okay. Yeah, but that I think that was only for like I like one year, a one year period. 
and then oh. it went away, or maybe less, like six months to a year. 